welcome dear student today we'll discuss about the question answers of the experiment study of osmosis by potato osmoscope okay now in this on the first page the what the diagram is given this diagram you have to complete first so you have to draw one line here so that indicates that the rise in the water level and here the level of the water it should go down okay because the water enter inside then here the level of the water inside the osmoscope get rise okay so this you have to show in this figure and then you have to mention there rise in water level okay now on the next page some questions are asked that we'll discuss so inference what inference we got in this experiment that a rise in the level of the sugar solution and the presence of the colored solution in potato osmoscope indicates that potato act as a semi permeable membrane due to which water from petri dish along with the color enter in the cavity of potato osmoscope so in my previous video already we have discussed regarding this how the water enter inside the osmoscope okay so from the petri dish colored water which enter inside the potato osmoscope that we already seen in that video okay so now first question potato is used to prepare an osmoscope justify why potato is used for the as a osmoscope that demonstration of the osmosis in the living system can be one using the potato osmoscope okay so this we can do with the help of the potato osmoscope a potato is peeled the skin is removed okay and one side is a flattened which serve as a base so because of that the potato can be remain stand on that particular petri dish this proves the entry of the water into the sugar solution through the potato tissue which serve as a selective permeable membrane so outer skin is removed and the base is a flat because of that from the outside means through the water whatever the petri dish is there through that water in enter inside the osmoscope where the sugar solution is a present okay so that's why here potato is get used so here it is a living tissue next question is there that is about the defined permeability so you have to write the definition here ability of the membrane to permit the passage of substances is called as a permeability okay third question is there define osmotic pressure osmotic pressure of a solution is the pressure which must be applied to the solution in order to prevent the entry of solvent due to osmosis so here from the outside water enter inside the osmoscope where inside the osmoscope the sugary solution is a present so that is what the osmotic pressure do you find any role of the osmosis in water purification yes so ro water you heard about the name ro water what is that ro water that is a reverse osmosis in water purification process that uses a partially permeable membrane to remove the ions unwanted molecules and the larger particles from drinking water so this water is there which is where in this the ions are removed unwanted molecules are removed and the larger particles are also removed that's why this water is what the ro water which is a pure form of the water next question is there that is about the osmosis play important role in the stomatal movement explain so stomata get open and close so opening and the closing of the stomata is controlled by what by the turgor of the guard cells so pore of the stomata which is covered by what the two guard cells are there so during the day time guard cells become a turgid due to the endosmosis water from the what are the surrounding cells enter inside the guard cells and that's why this cell become a turgid okay and that's why here that is a endosmosis and during the night time guard cells become a flaccid due to what exosmosis water comes out from the guard cells and goes in the surrounding cells and that makes what opening and the closing of the stomata multiple choice question so here in living cells on osmosis specifically refer to the moment that is a diffusion of water okay so this c is a correct answer the direction and the rate of osmosis is controlled by what that is a pressure gradient and a concentration gradient so c is a correct answer 
the structure that contributes to the solute potential of the cell is what that is about the water so c is a correct answer osmotic potential refer to what moment of water molecule from the hypotonic solution to the hypertonic solution that is from the lower concentration to the higher concentration so a is a correct answer which of the following is not semi permeable that is a cell wall okay while remaining three are the semi permeable cell wall is what fully permeable which is a present in the plant cell which acid used to extract the egg membrane so out of this the acetic acid is there which is used for the extraction of the egg membrane so this all answers you have to write in your practical book okay so you have to complete the practical book for which there are three marks are there okay so along with this question answers you can observe my video which is shown about the potato osmosis okay thank you now we'll see about the viva voce questions which are been asked during the exam about the potato osmoscope so here half mark is there for the viva questions any one or two viva question will be asked based on this experiment okay so first question suppose why potato is used to prepare the osmoscope okay as the potato is a living tissue okay potato is a living tissue living cells are present and in the living cells only the osmosis is taking place that's why the potato is used in the preparation of the osmoscope okay we can cut the potato in the cup shape structure we can make the hollow part inside and with the help of that you can easily recognize how the water travel inside that osmoscope okay can we use the boiled potato no we cannot use the boiled potato in this experiment because here once we boil the potato all the cells or the tissue is there all the cells of that tissue get die and where it do not show this type of the osmosis that's why here we cannot use the boiled potato what is the semi permeable membrane so what is the semi permeable membrane it is a layer that only certain molecules can pass through what is the semi permeable membrane is the layer that only certain molecules can pass through that is called as a semi permeable membrane so here the wall of the potato osmoscope is act as a semi permeable in this experiment what is osmosis so what is osmosis it is a spontaneous passage it is a spontaneous passage or the diffusion of the water or the other solvents through the semi permeable membrane that is called as a osmosis okay next is there what is a endosmosis or what is a exosmosis so what is endosmosis endosmosis endo means inside so moment of the water inside the cell moment of the water inside the cell when the cell is a placed in the hypotonic solution so here potato osmoscope we keep this in the hypotonic solution that is in the water and inside the osmoscope the concentrated sugar solution is a present so water from the outside it enter inside the osmoscope that is a endosmosis and what is exosmosis exosmosis means what that the elimination of water out of the out of that particular uh, cells we can say uh, we take, we'll take the example of the exosmosis that is about the resins so dry whatever the grapes are there when we keep in the water it get swells so that is because of what because of the exosmosis next why concentrated sugar solution is taken in the experiment why the sugar solution is taken because the sugar solution is what it is a hypertonic solution which is taken inside that osmoscope okay so that's why water from outside enter inside that particular osmoscope so that is called endosmosis why potato is peeled off why potato is peeled off because peel means what that the skin skin of the potato which is a uh, not semi permeable so that's why that we have to remove then only we can get the osmosis process why colored water is taken in this experiment now here if you take the colored water easily we can recognize that water it travel from the outside to inside that osmoscope inside that potato osmoscope so that's why the colored water is uh, taken without colored water also we can get but easily we can understand with the help of this colored water only so in the experiment i showed this with the help of the colored water where i have taken the beet so natural color level of the sugar solution is rises explain level of the sugar solution rises why because from the outside what is the water is there which enter inside that osmoscope so endosmosis takes place so that's why sugar level what is the it, it rises sugar solution level get rises unless and until it balance 
the concentration till that time here the water continuously travel inside okay so these are what the viva questions are there and along with number of all questions which are given in the this practical book about the experiment they may ask so out of this any one or two question will be asked during the board exam by the external examiner or by your teacher okay so here this everything is explained about this potato osmoscope along with the viva along with what are the question answers we have discussed in the previous what are the page okay so thank you if you like my channel subscribe so that you can get the another what are the question answers along with the viva questions in the about the next experiment okay thank you